Yeah, hey everyone, Brian with you from the Game Common, and today we are starting a brand new series. We are playing a game called Broken Lines. So, I know next to nothing about this game other than I played the tutorial. So, essentially with Frostpunk wrapping up, I was looking for a new series to play, and I'm planning on hopping into some more Stellaris with the Federation update, uh, the new DLC that's coming out, but that's not till like the uh, middle of March. So, I had like 15 days I needed to figure out what we were gonna do with, and so I was kind of cruising through Steam and I ran across this game. So Broken Lines is a game that launched last week. Uh, the description is that it's a story driven tactical RPG set in an alternate history version of World War II. It's a game about a group of eight soldiers who crash land behind enemy lines. It's up to you to help them uh, help lead them home while fending off an enemy and helping them to deal with the horrors of war. So what's rather interesting about this game is it's a tactical RPG and it's turn based RPG. So immediately it kind of reminds you of XCOM but based on the tutorial and some of the reviews it's not directly XCOM like where like you move one troop and then they move a troop and so on and so forth rather it's like you give all your troops orders and then they basically act out the next eight seconds which makes for some rather crazy uh, combat fights because you're like all right I want you to go here and toss a grenade but where they toss the grenade all of a sudden the enemies have already moved because they're moving at the exact same time and it just it seems like a really interesting and cool concept and so I'm excited to hop in and see what the game's about. It has not too many reviews, but almost all of them have been positive. It has a very positive review right now on Steam. So uh, all those reasons, I was like, yeah, let's hop in. Let's try it out. So we're going to create a new game. I basically just created this just to see. Uh, well, I forgot there was a tutorial, and so I was like, crap. So we're just going to override it because there literally was nothing else going on. Um, we will do medium because I honestly don't know. I think it's going to be a little more difficult based on the tutorial because that skirmish I was like, ah, oh, yeah, the last tutorial was like, hey, here's a skirmish. You're three guys against their four guys. And I was like, okay, no problem. And then after the first time, I was like, I want to try that again. Because, you know, my great strategy, like my one guy was like, all right, toss a grenade and everyone else go fan out. Except I forgot that by the time they tossed the grenade, my characters had already run like halfway across the uh, a map without cover because the smoke grenade hadn't exploded yet. And I was like, oh my gosh. Like, so there's definitely a whole new level of strategy we're gonna have to consider here that we're not used to. So I don't know if there's voice acting. Uh, location, Eastern Europe, year 1944. Crew, 42 allied troops. Mission, recon, and sabotage. It Target classified. An unusually hazy night. I like the, the artwork too. believe they are crossing over neutral territory. She sounds the Russian. Their mission is classified, known only to commanders on another plane. Like, from our side or the other side? <laughs> Who are these commanders? Are there aliens? It says alternate history. There might be aliens for all we know. Instruments break down first. Pointers spin wildly. Alarms blaring, and then the engines stop. Do we literally survive? Okay, I was gonna say, do we survive a plane crash in World War II? That's pretty good. <laughs> kind of hard to survive a plane crash. It happens, but a single soul awakes, shocked and confused. He doesn't know where he is or what his orders are. He runs to the crash site, terrified that he might be the only survivor. Eh, it's you and seven others, <laughs> apparently. All right, so we got a couple abilities here. This is our dude, Recruit Avery. Uh, yeah, this is just the tutorial. We have Suppressive Fire, so we can click it and basically just put down Suppressive Fire. Or we also have Bandage Heal, Soldiers by Moderate Amount. Okay, um, uses permission, three of three. Interesting. What's Bullet Storm? I wonder if that's just like his class. I'm not 100% sure on that. All right. So basically, to move, we uh, left click, and then when we left click, we can kind of queue up action. So you can see that's going to take 4.5 seconds. Now, a single turn is comprised of eight seconds. The thing is, you can't change what happens. So for example, if we move 4.5 seconds and meet enemies, we're not going to be able to stop what we're doing. We're going to continue 
continue on until eight seconds are done. Now, in our normal move stance, we will start shooting the enemy if we see him, but um, what we're gonna end up doing is I'm actually gonna do some more sneaking moves, so we have different stances. We can basically run, but we can't shoot. We can kind of normal shoot, reduce accuracy, or we're gonna do uh, the slower speed, harder to hit, and holds fire. Oh, you actually don't, f wait, you don't shoot on this one? I thought this one you shot. Holds fire, shoots while moving, holds fire. Oh, okay, so you can only shoot in the middle one. So you see that takes 5.1 seconds, so it's a little bit slower. Once again, I'm basically just trying to like look for an eight second one. So we will have basically 0.1 second of move after our turn. So we're basically just gonna kinda um, run through here. I could probably do full speed, cause I imagine, you know, this being the big first mission, it's not gonna be super terribly difficult. But anyways, we'll stay here. We, uh, this is normal walk, okay? So we actually have 0.3 seconds left. That's weird. But let's just go ahead and keep moving up here. Let's kind of avoid the fire. I imagine it wouldn't do too much damage, but we'll see. Get down. Ah, Nem Nurmrik Retraka. What? Ah. Who's there? Drop the gun and take off your mask. Dot Krim Antrika. Is this Stargate? <laughs> Is this cold? Fine, you ask for this. All right, Avery. So we still have two seconds left. Can I cancel it? Aha. Okay, so you can cancel at the end of two seconds. So your shoulder automatically shoots at enemies who are within weapon ranges. They will automatically switch to the threat who is nearest to their line of sight. Uh, moving while shooting slightly reduces fire rates. So do we have cover over here? So you can see we have a 75% chance to shoot him. He has a 0% chance to shoot us. If we move, you can see it drops. There actually seems to be a reduction in accuracy the closer you move. Um, now you'll notice how it looks like he has a 0% chance. I think it's because he has no gun out. Oh no, he actually, oh, it's because his pistol doesn't have range on me. Interesting. So is there something to be said? I wonder about moving away from him. I don't know. I also don't know if you'll shoot while moving back. That's a good question. The other thing is, if we had cover, it would show up as blue between us, uh, between that 75% and zero. So there's no cover here. So I'm just going to let our guy automatically shoot. I'm not going to move because that was our best percentage chance. He did get a sh couple shots at us, but we did get to finish him. Is he a zombie? He kind of looked like a zombie, man. Just going to be honest. All right. I think we're good on this tutorial. Holding the cursor reveals your cover. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hit chance. You'll see there's what the armor looks like or the cover looks like. So we'll keep moving up for the time being and just keep exploring. Now, the downside, there's no loot. So you can see, like, we didn't have enough moves for the entire eight seconds. So essentially, we just kind of stood there, which isn't necessarily the worst thing in the world, but could be issues here in the future. When question mark appears over hovering specific objects, press the right mouse button to gain information about them. Okay, good to know. I've not seen that one. What is this, by the way? Is this cover? I think that might be cover. This is gonna be a little bit short of a turn again, or we'll have a couple extra. Yeah, okay, nothing really over here. Ah, cover rock. Aha, I understand. So that was cover. So 40% enemy, less suppression, less explosive damage. Good, 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 good. Well, let's just go move up here since we saw that uh, if we meet an enemy, we can reset turns. Uh, whoa, 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 whoa. Recruit Wood. Wood, thank God, are you all right? It's splendid. Thanks for asking. Just need to get the intentions back in my stomach. I'll be as good as new. This isn't time to be funny, mate. You started it. Anyway, what happened? We were, Why were we shot down over neutral territory? Apparently, we're British. Uh, I think PMCs or whatever. I've got no bloody clue what's going on either. First things first, mate. Be dear and revive me, would you? Okay, so what was that thing about the status? You only have one soldier selected at a time. Okay, I wanted to go back. Watch out for the stats. Health is the green bar. Stress is the orange bar. Okay, when below 50% health, accuracy is reduced by 15, and speed and courage are reduced by 25. Incoming fire sh increases stress and reduces hit chance. So, the more stress, the less likely you are to take hits. Good to know. Does that revive? I'm gonna hope that that just means reviving. Okay, it looked like he was reloading his gun there. So now we have Recruit Wood up. I. He has knockdown, which essentially gives him a shotgun that knocks down an enemy. And then basically you can, uh, uh, he can't act until they stand up. Let's go ahead and heal ourselves, And let's just chill for now and see how this works. I've not used the heal before. Is it just a passive heal over time then? Mm -hmm. How much healing does it do? 
by smaller amount of radius. Ah, okay, so you can heal multiple ones. But it didn't really describe how much healing it does, okay. but okay, that's fine. All right, let's just move you guys up here together. And so they're going to move out together. We have the same stance right now, character selection. We knew all this or know all this. A couple extra turns. I really should go extra eight seconds. All right, here's cover, so we're just going to move over to cover. That's nine seconds. That sounds fine. It's a little freaky being able to tell whether or not you're moving into cover sometimes, but... We will see how, once we actually get into combat, if we can make it work. Now, there is a timer ticking down below. I don't know. We'll stay, we'll go from this cover to the next cover. I don't know if, like, you get uh, ratings after each mission and if the time is based on that. So we're a little under eight seconds. But we're just going to move from cover to cover. Excited. Ah, contact. Dom Pitak. Dom Pitak. Dai... This isn't German, right? It's World War II. Gunfire, what the hell? Run, we can't fight from here. We have to get to higher ground. Oh, yeah, so he's got an advantage over us because we have higher ground. But what we can do is we can probably... My assumption is we want to go here. Get into cover. Then we want to come through here in cover while uh, walking would be my assumption. I mean, that, that seems like the smartest thing, right? So get into cover. So the stress is going up. But I don't think they have any chance to yes. uh, do damage. All right. Now we're going to run like we're going to die if we don't. Yes. <laughs> and then go there. So they still have to finish their move. But then go, 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 go. He took some damage. That's okay. That's okay. Always watch the stress. Whoa, 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 whoa. Calm down, calm down. I hadn't read these. Uh, the make or break a battle. Use concentrated fire to suppress the enemy. Soldiers and decreases their hit chance. Da, da, da. They'll panic. When it's full, your soldier panics for a short time and you can't control them. Uh, the soldier instead seeks nearby cover to gain defensive bonus. If an enemy soldier panics, they react simula similarly. Okay, good to know. Good to know. I'm assuming we're just going to have to keep moving on and then we're going to have to come flank them around this way. So... Um, I am all for just running. I think. Yes. I don't know if he has a shot on us or not, but let's just move. Hmm? Ah! Shaman, is that you? Hmm. Get behind Kelba, there's a freak in a mask shooting at me from the path ahead. Just the one, why haven't you downed him yet? Well, he's got the terrain in his favor, but now that you're here, we should have the upper hand. Your bravery is inspiring me. Oi, you know, I'm just the tech guy they chucked a rifle at back at camp. I didn't even volunteer for this OP. Hey, Sherman, I feel you, man. Enough chit-chat. Let's get back to the bastard already. Um, okay. Weapons. The rifles are best at long distance. Mid-range shotguns are deadly up close. Okay. Can you shoot from where you're at? Doesn't look like it. So you're just going to come down here. Nah, nah, nah. That's not what I wanted. You're going to come and run down here. All right, let's just get everyone together. And then we will go this way. This doesn't look stable. It really doesn't. It really doesn't. Okay, so we are all together now. Let's run up to this cover, and this could be a really bad idea. But once again, I think if we meet someone else, it should reset our turn. I'm digging it. I kind of like the whole eight-second thing. Okay. Okay, we got to be a little slower then. We, we kind of screwed that up. <laughs> so the new guy... What does he have? Knockdown, where's Sherman? I want to see what Sherman has. Yeah, eh, there we go. I'm using E or Q and E to try rotating and it doesn't work. So suppressive yes. fire, you have aim. All right, aim is just a high uh, 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 chance shot. You got the shotgun, which will hopefully put him down. And I will just suppressive fire just to keep him suppressed. So now he's down. Yeah, okay, good. That was kind of what I was hoping for. The suppressive would just keep him down. Okay, so we learned that if we meet them before our eight seconds, I guess because we're already in combat. I guess that's what it's probably teaching us is that, hey, you're already in combat, so Aye. you don't get, like, another opportunity. So we're just going to move you guys out here and just be as careful as possible. I want to get just a little bit of vision down here and see whether or not, okay, this is fine. Wasted turns, yeah, but, like, I would rather hide behind here 
than to run out here, find an enemy, and find that we're completely screwed. So I think that's probably okay. safe. Probably yes. safe, and this is probably safe. And then here's the other thing, if we see them, we're not running so we can actually shoot. So I'd say most of the time we probably want to run normally, would be the thought. Where are these other guys? They're still up a little further. This is cover, cover sandbags, cover barrel. Cover has no effect if the enemy's too close and the soldier there are firing at vice versa, okay. So we will put you here, Mr. Hi. Sherman, Mr. Woods, We'll go right there. And Mr. Avery, sorry, recruit Avery Woods and Sherman will all move like this. All right, so if we see an enemy, we do contact. Okay, so apparently we left combat then. I think this is fine though. The only thing is when you get there, go ahead and aim for the kill. Fine. And when you get there, aim for the suppressive fire and we're gonna assume uh, you know what? Let's not let's not do it. Let's not do it. Let's just you go there and you guys can just keep shooting. So he's not taking his sniper shot yet. That should be right here. Okay, apparently he did take it. So take the shot. I think this is too far for knockdown. Yeah, it's too far for knockdown. So you just do your normal shooting and then we will suppress you. And the idea again is the suppression will keep him from moving. Alright, and we sniped him in the back <laughs> totally not the butt that was the back <laughs> which somehow doesn't really make it sound any better but okay uh do we have to search at all cover tent no it doesn't look like it i don't know if there's like a looting mechanic in the yes. game i wish there was though because this game seems like it'd be really cool with the looting mechanic let's stress him out i mean he's dead y you can try but he literally is dead. So let's move, what is this? This is actually kind of really terrible cover. So let's go ahead and move all the way up here then. I have to put you right here. It's a little hard figuring out whether or not they're in co cover. How did we get them to hop over? I wonder if we could do that differently to actually force them to hop over. I don't know. So we know there are guys right here. Flanking is a pretty big thing I mean, they spent a lot of time in the tutorial teaching you how to flank, so. Now, here's the thing. Our abilities don't really help us because we don't have anyone we can target, so we will just move up, and we got contact. All right, so it started a new one. Good. Now, we could throw explosive grenade, and I think I'm actually going to. I'm going to throw it right here. Uh, hold up. We're going to assume they're going to run for this cover right here. So that's why we're going to throw a grenade right there. He's already in cover, so he's good to go. Uh, yes. Then we want you come in here. Let's get rid of you. Let's actually get you right up on Yes. cover. And then same thing here. Let's get you actually flanking all the way over here. And then you can suppress over in this direction. We'll see how this works. I thought there were two guys. So the grenade should hit both of them. And you're getting suppressed. Suppression also destroys cover, which is nice. Uh, grenade variants, hand grenades, rifle grenades. Oh, rifle grenades. Long range, high cover damage, high damage. Smoke grenade blocks line of sight, concussion grenade. Concussion, low damage, high stress. Did not realize. Does he have HP or is he dead? I think he's covering right now. Okay. We're gonna do this and come knock you down. And let's just aim and go for the kill. He, oh, okay, there's his HP. He was not, oh, that sucks. I didn't realize he didn't have vision. All right, well, that worked. Okay, okay, we gotta pay a little closer attention here. Space to continue. We were lucky to survive all that. I don't feel lucky, I feel sick. What would I give to be home again? Should be fairly easy to manage. You just have to climb past those massive mountains in the distance and avoid being gunned down all the way by the mass ginks in the way. Yo, that sounds kind of racist. Just throwing that out there. What is this place anyways? Why are we here? That's a question for the lieutenant, assuming their plane's not a flaming wreckage like ours is. Oh, we don't know what we're doing. The lieutenants in another plane know what we're doing. I understand the intro now. I spotted a few guys jumping out of plane with parachutes. We should look for them tomorrow morning. Well, there's still five of us somewhere. And there is a chick in the uh, cover art. So I imagine one of them's a girl. Oi, fine. So move up, move up, mm -hmm. and move up. We probably could just run, but whatever. 
whatever. Let's just get out of here. The mission ends when the soldier reaches the mission goal. The mission goal is visible as the banner icon. Sometimes there can be additional conditions. You can read these by examining the mission. Okay, so continue. In the prologue missions, wrecked uncertainty and release, you can retry level as much as you want without any penalties. Are there any benefits? Do we go into the next mission with like a current HP or something or current stuff? I don't know. So time target was 420. We did in 321. So we got a 1.4. We killed five out of the three target and we downed one instead of two. I don't know what down means. Shorter time completion, more enemy kills, fewer squad casualties, increase your final score. Is that how many times we got downed? I don't know. So it looks like we got a good score. I suppose. By nightmares of a strange enemy wearing strange masks, the survivors get through the night. What have they stumbled into? Zombies. They have no idea. Okay. I wish they would tell me it was the end of the mission. In between missions, the soldiers rest at their campfires. They progress through their campaign. More actions will be available to perform here. Oh, so it's like Darkest Dungeon here. Go to sleep. Can we do anything real quick? I guess we can go to sleep. <laughs> okay. All right. Yeah, that seems a little bit like Darkest Dungeon, which is really kind of cool. If we have, like, stress levels, we have to heal and HP and stuff like that. I can... I'm, I'm on board with this game, though, so far. It's only been 20 minutes, but I am on board. Start. Is this a, oh, this is another prologue mission. I gotcha, I think. More lucky survivors. One wonders, what brought these soldiers to this place? Does it have to do with the Russians? Will the locals welcome them? Probably not. Or will more blood be shed? Probably. Considering how evil you sound, I'm gonna have to say probably more blood. Hey, at least we're already together. Three veteran soldiers who jumped out of the plane gathered the next morning. Veteran Haley, Veteran King, and Veteran Morgan. Oh, because the others were recruits, right? Hmm. I still hate parachuting no matter how many times I do it. Mine nearly jammed would have been a nasty way to go hitting the ground at full speed. Splat. Lovely imagery there, King. I think the one who jumped out uh, were in the direction of the village. Let's go find them. All right. So what, what makes you a veteran, I guess? More crap? Adrenaline, adrenaline, pump up the soldier, increasing their courage and speeding up their movement. Heal a selected ally by a moderate amount versus heal by a large amount. Okay, okay. Yes. Then let's see, you got knocked down and concussive grenade. Yes. You got marked target. Ooh. Oh, but only three uses per mission. Hmm. All right. Well, let's go ahead and move you up. This is cover, right? Yeah. So we'll take you up there. That's seven seconds. You guys can hold. Is this fence count as cover? Slightly, slightly. So let's see, you have rifle, so your range, your mid range, your short range. Good to know. All right, let's just go. Remember, if we meet the enemies, stay back and blow a hole in that fence ahead. Save your ammo, just jump over it, you moron. <laughs> yeah, just jump over it, man. I'm just, I'm gonna jump over it. Can I jump over it? Are they going to let me jump over it? Yes. You know, yeah, they're just going to let me jump over it. <laughs> I'm just going to jump over it. I'm going to be lazy. Hmm. I know suppressive fire and, like, okay. we can use grenades and stuff like that. Also, speaking of which, yes. do we have a certain number of grenades? Does anyone Fine. have grenades? Fine. Yeah, three grenades. So three grenades per mission. That's actually kind of nice. Down. Versus just one. All right, so there's our contact. Ooh, I'm gonna take the shotgun dude up here. Uh, hold up, no, 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 let's cancel your current move. I'm gonna bring you up here and we're gonna go for the knockdown. Is there a way to like, I don't know if this is gonna work. I wanna try something. I wanna do knockdown first. I know he's not in range. Then we're gonna move and we're gonna knock down again. So the hope is as soon as he moves in range, he triggers the knockdown. I don't know if that's how it's gonna work, but we can try. You are good getting into cover. And then let's aim and shoot. I'm going to let you yes. move normally so you can take hopefully a shot before then. And then you kind of have kind of bad accuracy here, but this will be okay. And we will suppressive fire like this in hopes that the guy is still somewhat in that range. Oh, there are two guys. Oh, shoot. I still had him going in that direction. Okay, did not anticipate the other freaking five guys here. So this could be a problem. So uh, get rid of the suppressive fire. 
Ah, oh, it's currently executing. Shoot. Shoot. I need you to die. Yes. No, Mr. Bond, I need you to live. Wait a second. Uh, toss a Kanesh. Yeah, so you did get knocked down, so we're gonna concuss you guys, and hopefully you got, uh, you'll stay alive. Mm -hmm. Um, what are you gonna do when you're done? I don't really want to mark target. I'm just gonna let you shoot. You should be shooting at these guys. Because they're the closest target, and from my understanding, they shoot the closest target. Okay. So can I suppressive fire over here? Nah, not really. Do we concuss either of them? I don't think so. Yeah, I don't think so. It's a 45%. That seems kind of bad. So we need to look at flanking right now, but I don't really know a good opportunity to flank here. Yes. Yo, you have unlimited uses. 5% with a 40% there. If we do this with that and then go for the knockdown again, Yes. Does this count as cover? This counts as cover. We have slightly better odds than both of them. So I think I'm okay with you moving there. With a 15% chance, that kind of sucks. But, oh, let's get into cover. Yeah. But then that's a nice little 60% there. So let's do this. Don't shoot me. I think we missed our knockdown. Pretty sure we missed our knockdown. All right, let's aim. That's 95%. Okay. I can live with that. Then we will suppressive fire this other guy. Just so he stops attacking. Yeah, I know you're injured. Well, this isn't going so hot for this guy. Um... Gotta remember, she's long range right now. So I think we just leave her back. We're gonna totally die here. Hi, I'm gonna retreat you and hopefully you don't die. I think you lost cover technically. That guy's going down. Okay, we killed them at the same time. Wow, that was a little more difficult. We're learning, we're learning. For sure, are those the villagers? Soldiers surprise the masked enemies in the middle of a gruesome scene. Hmm. Bloody hell, look at all those bodies. Those inhumane bastards are committing mass murder. I mean, she kinda looks not really human either, but the bodies don't have any bolt hose through, just swollen faces, scratches, bite marks. Whatever it was, these faceless slots must be behind it. They must, uh, they ought to rot in hell. So, he's bloody right now? I wonder if it's because he took so much damage. I actually think that actually is the case. All right, I need... I'm gonna move you over here. Uh, I didn't mean to wait. Whatever. But we're gonna go to heal him real quick. We got plenty of okay. healing packs. We'll use the super heal. We still have another one. Keep going up a little quicker. Yeah, please heal me a little more than that. I hope it's still gonna go up a little further, but now the question is, are we technically in combat right now? Yes. I don't know. So if we run across another group, are we gonna have to restart combat? Well, so our healing's not going up anymore. Is that because Fine. that was all we could heal or because we started moving? Yes. I don't know. We gotta be a little careful with our shotgun guy here in our next fight. Take we won't down. run him out. So there's contact. Okay, so it is a whole new group. Um, how do we want to attempt this one? So I think our only hope here yes. is going to be yes. to suppress. Yes. So I need you. Oh, he's in cover too. Uh, let's do it this way. Hold up. I need you to run full speed. Just so you can get up there as quick as possible and start the suppression. Yes. Then with her. 
don't really have a way to shoot this guy all that well. That seems to be okay. And we're gonna run up here as well. Now, surely the suppressing fire, we won't hurt ourselves. All right, we blew his cover up. Okay, that worked, that worked. That actually worked pretty well for us. Um, I don't think we took any more damage. Brick, uh, higher health, more courage. Health increased by 25, courage increased by 20. Okay, that's what that means. Take them down. Uh, marks and prioritizes for 16 seconds. Their invasions reduced by 20. Okay, and then what was yours? Quick fix. Heal soldiers by a moderate amount. First aid that can heal soldiers. So basically you have heal ally uh, in addition. All right, we'll move you up here. We'll move you up here. I don't think there's anything else. Also, I think that means they're reloading. I don't think there's a way to reload. There probably is a way to reload. I just hadn't figured that out yet. Now, once again, did we loo uh, leave combat? Is that what this means? I don't know what any of this means. Did we, we stop, oh, dang it. I stopped his move. All right, so we were not in combat. Uh, camouflage, an alternate to physical coverage, camouflages. Soldiers who are hidden in bushes are more difficult. They are harder to see and enemies cannot focus on them. Watch it because the enemies might be using it as well. Hi. So here, go into camouflage. Yes. You're not going to have really okay. good odds to see no matter what. And you're not going to be able to shoot, so... Yep, there's the enemy using it. If I'm quiet, the enemy won't see me. Dun, 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 yeah, dun, dun, dun. Do we want a concussive grenade here? And then wait? Okay. Mark target? I kind of feel like... I should be able to hit. 65% is not great. Yes. Um, let's go ahead and mark target. I hate that this is like only three times because I feel like that's going to be one of those abilities that I'm not going to use as much as I could. And we're just going to move you through here. And we'll have 15% chance, but might as well. All right, that marked target, I don't know triggered right away. She's reloading. Yes. Just keep shooting this guy because we seem to be fairly safe right now. Why aren't you shooting is what I'm wondering. <laughs> what are these guys saying? Yes. Yeah, just keep keep shooting this guy. Surely he's gonna die here eventually. All right, or you just miss. Mm -hmm. Okay, it's time for us to throw a concussion grenade, and then okay. I'm gonna move you around to here, and then we're gonna rush this guy. You basically didn't get a shot. Okay. All right, run into cover. Mm -hmm. Run into cover. And once again, they should just auto shoot. <laughs> All right, we're in cover now. Took some damage, but wasn't too terrible. Freaking King, man. He's just getting wrecked here. All right, let's move her up to here just to see whether or not we can see any enemies. Doesn't look like it. We will put you here at the window. Oh, Not that I fine. think there's gonna be anything in the window, but yes. do some exploration. And then we'll put you over there. Or uh, just to see if there's anything inside. Okay, there's nothing inside here. I wish you could like quick in turn, that would be nice. We'll move you here, move you here. And who's our other guy? Bye. Sherman, or sorry, Morgan. Sherman's the last one. Do we want to heal again? Yes. I think so. I think I am going to heal ally. We still got a couple more heals left, so. Oh, that's how long it heals for. I understand now. Okay. Okay. Well, let's take yes. you up here. Let's take you up here. Let's take you up here. That's 3.9 seconds. Um. 
I also wish there was a button where it was like, just go eight seconds of movement. How far is eight seconds of movement? That would be kind of nice to see. Which way are we going? Looks like we're still going this way. I wonder if there's gonna be branching paths eventually. Contact. Connor, there you are. It's standing in higher ground, improve the hit chances of the soldier. Yeah, 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 we know about that. Uh, space, continue. Yo, go away. Space. Shh, you're in my ambush, you asshats. I can't use space. Good to see you. Since you're here, help me take them down. Okay. So she's ambushing. She's got some aim. She's got some smoke grenades. Um, you got 100% chance. You might as well go take it. Uh, this is veteran Haley. Actually, hold up. Let's get rid. Uh, nah, you can run and shoot, and then we'll aim, and you'll go kill that guy. Okay. And then you guys are just gonna come up here and just keep shooting. Okay. Just keep shooting. Just keep shooting. So even though I'm hitting aim, they should still take a second action. Wow, we did not unfortunately get them killed. Uh, let's go ahead and suppress them so that they have to stop moving. Well, that was disappointing. Cannot hit from range. Hi, sniper peoples. Can you murder them? I really don't want to have to like move forward here. Really? <laughs> really? Really? Ah, uh, it's 25%. Ugh. Okay. What is this? 45%. I mean, Aye. it's slightly better, I suppose. 45%. Aye. Zero percent. Whatever. You got a 5% shot? My gosh. Move here. Take a 60. Okay. We got a chance. Is he still healing? I don't know what's up. Maybe it's because he's stressed. That might have been it. Might have been just because he was stressed. He just didn't want to move. All right. Uh, we're done. We're done. Let's go ahead and start moving up to the bridge. Hold up. Let's clear out. There also should be a clear out all actions. And there might be. There might very well be. Okay, so let's move you up here. King, let's get you up here. Okay. Morgan, let's get you up here. Right. And Kana, let's get you up here. So we got two range guys, Enemy which sighted. I'm liking. Damn it, we have to cross the open bridge. There's a rifleman ready to take pot shots at us from that house over there. I'm wondering if we have to use a smoke grenade. There you go. Brilliant, throw one in front of his window. Once he's blinded, the rest of us can cross the bridge and enter. Yes, I know how smoke grenades work. King, get ready. Okay, so uh, once again, let's go ahead and cancel everyone's action. I wish you could see his range. See how far he could go, or uh, how far he can shoot us. So I need you to throw the smoke grenade. Oh, that's a really bad range. Okay, then. Um, change of plans. Let us go here and go slower speed. Slower speed. Slower speed. Yes. Slower speed. 5.2, oh, 3.8, 3.6.8 seconds. So let's just get everyone there. It's gonna be a little bit of wasted time. What's the down mean? He's taking pot shots at us, but we're also taking pot shots at him. Okay, so now we throw our grenade. That's gonna take a total of four seconds. Let's see if we can time this right. I need you to wait. Wait normally. Wait four seconds, and then you're gonna beeline it over here. I actually am gonna do it this way. Yeah, I'm gonna do it this way. Then you are also gonna wait four seconds. And you can take shots during it. I don't really care about that. And then beeline over here. And then I think I'm going to keep Haley. We'll just take some shots here with you. And then you're throwing the grenade. We could probably move, but... Ow, we took damage. All right, there's the smoke. Boom! With the time! Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, that feels good, dude. That yes. feels good. All right, you guys just keep moving. Okay. Hmm. Just keep moving. Let's go ahead and get in this house. You go for that. 
And I'm actually gonna lead with King here. So what I want is I want King, I want you to run in here, and then I want you to put him on the ground. Hopefully before he can respond. There is another guy over here. Die, scum. And we are standing at the door. All right, I think he did. I think he did, I didn't really pay too much attention. Is he dead? Are you dead? I can't see. I Pretty sure he did. What does this look like? That is actually bad for us. So hey, hide behind cover real quick while we wait for the smoke to dissipate. And then there's this guy over here. We're gonna come here, can we take a shot at him? No, too far away. So just move up here. Just move up here and we're gonna uh, basically decide what we want to do after this. Okay, let the smoke dissipate. Yes. How do we want to do dish? I could potentially suppress. Yes. So maybe in the 35% because I think this counts as technically being in the door cover. And then we're gonna suppress him, hopefully. While that's going on, that's gonna be 3.8 seconds plus 0 0.9. I'm gonna grab okay. you, you're gonna wait. Let's say, let's just be safe and say like four seconds. And then I'm gonna have you come up here and probably go for a knockdown shot. Uh, then you guys are gonna wait, like let's say one second and then come on up here I think we're learning the strat on this. I, with the whole waiting stuff, I'm digging it. I'm digging it a lot, actually. 1.1, sure, whatever. And then you come up there, and you can aim. Did we aim with her? Nah, we should aim when you're up here. Okay. So you're coming here, taking a shot, suppressing, which should hopefully keep him down. He took a shot at us. The suppression did not really do what I wanted it to do. <laughs> yeah, I don't think we technically got him suppressed. All right, well, let's try this and then suppressing you from here. And then you guys just, whatever, just shoot. Okay. And there's our suppression. Nice, nice. It's a bad idea to run head on to that village. We could use the fields for camouflage. We're better off using the fences and higher ground to the right. I am with the fences and higher ground. So let's move through this field and come through here and then come up here and then take shots at them from up here. I like it. I like it. I like it. So let's come here. Uh, do we need heals? Eh, I'm going to save because we're somewhat low. And let's just stack up here in a line. Isn't this a stack? There's a, there's a specific... Shoot. There's a specific... term for that. Or do we come and kill this guy? I actually think we're gonna change our plan and kill this guy. Yes. All right, let's cancel our moves. I. Yes. She is pretty hurt though. Give me Morgan. We don't have suppressive fire right now. Oh my god. Yes. Can you see right now? I think the yellow means you can't. So let's take you here and you currently still don't have views. 10%. Well, this is not good. Or we can put you literally at point blank range. That doesn't seem to help much. All right. Well, this is awkward. Um, okay. Hey, yes, King. Fine. Let's do this. And you stay uh, here, and let's put yes. Connor here as well. Let's just get them crossing. What? Why are you? What? Why are you moving, buddy? Get down! Die, scum! I'm a little confused right now. Yes. Is he still alive? I think he's alive. Let's go yes. finish you off. I'm not quite sure what happened here. Meaning, yes. you weren't supposed to continue this attack. Let's just be aggressive here. 
and just like move out and hopefully get the kill. All right, shotgun guy did not do so hot right here. Well, that is very unfortunate. Well, this is bad. Let's go up here. Let's go shoot you. He has a 20% chance and he still hit me? Kind of mad about that, just to be honest. Uh, we'll shotgun you again. We're going to come up here in the field. Don't really have good odds at all. Where's this other guy? I mean, might as well just put you here so at least you can keep shooting. And then, yeah, same thing. Just get you guys going. All right, we knocked him down again. He's not dead. Now he's dead. Yes. Now, I think I should be able to move here without being shot. Okay, we're safe. So then what this means is it's time for first aiding everyone uh not you i want to use haley's first aid because this is a nice wide this should get all of us and then you guys just hang out right here okay we good we good this one's taking us a little yes. bit longer than the other one but that's fine so how do we want to do this man we know that you're up there how long is that 12 seconds my concern is who is over here. Oh, shoot. So I think I kind of want to go over here just to be safe. Because we don't know who else is over there. Okay. I. I. Mm -hmm. Oh, wait, that was her. Yes. I didn't give you abilities. Okay, let's come up and around. And I would rather get them up top and then go from there. Hostiles. Okay. So that was eight seconds, which is good because that means we can uh, reset these abilities and go from there. Um, Let's start with her. Can I get her into cover? Yes, with an aim. Go ahead and get the murder. Uh, same thing with Haley. This counts as cover. And then take the shot. King, not really a fan of any of your spots right here. So I think we're just going to run you over here. I think that's probably our better option, just so you uh, take less damage, or at least hopefully the enemy can't see you as well. And this is 55%. I'm going to do the same thing. We're going to run you here. And then once you're there, let's go ahead and suppress this guy in case he, if he's still alive. So hopefully we're taking shots. It's so chaotic right now. All right, so our, so our suppression actually worked fairly well here. Yes. Don't know we hit him. This is 35%. Oh, I fine. Smoke grenade, eh. 15%. Uh. Mm -hmm. What is your odds of hitting? 0%. He's got the elevation on us. <sighs> and he's got a chance that he can actually hit us right now. Mm -hmm. Boo. Yes. Can we come in through the window? No, we cannot. But I think we discovered there's no one in this stupid house. Why can't I scale the window, man? Get me inside the window. I don't like this. We're out of concussion. Yes. Two. What about this? Mark target. And then let's take some shots. Okay. I. And 0%, so we'll move What's you here. Move? Okay, cover went away. That's essentially what we were aiming for. Um, Mr. Shotgun Buddy, let's go ahead and run you inside the house. There's a treasure chest in here. Oh, I could have gone through the back door? I wonder if you can open doors. Well, we'll try. And then everyone else, he's kind of worthless right now. I'm just gonna be honest. 0% chance, really? 
I kind of feel like that's not Bye. true. But we'll put everyone up here and see what this looks like. Now, we probably can just get to the end and be done with it. We did hit this guy. Uh, okay, good. Can we open the chest or anything? Can we open the door? No, it doesn't look like it. All right, well then, in that case, let's go here, let you take the shot. Let's try the suppression and see if we can actually hit him. 80%, you will probably kill him. You have 0% chance there, so I'm just gonna let you shoot. Need to get nearer to hit. Hostiles. Really? So you actually have 25% if I move you. You have a 0% and a 0%. Put you here, and hopefully you can come kill this guy. And we're just gonna take random shots around. And we got a really good spot, so I'm kinda like, let's just like hang up here and just keep shooting. So this is 30% chance, not really good odds. We'll see if we can knock you out of cover. Uh, we hated that 60% chance to shoot us. That is not cool. This is... Not really any better. It's a 45% chance to hit. It's a 35% chance. I mean, two 50-50s gives us a chance. They're not really doing any damage on us, so I'm kind of cool with this. Also, we're blowing up the cover. Unfortunately, he just blew up my cover. So keep moving. You guys just keep shooting because they can't really do anything to us right now. We did kill this one guy. The This guy's hanging out over there. Can't really yes. do anything with him. All right, 55, 50. He's got a 20. I will take yes. that. And then you got really good odds here. And you got decent odds there. Go to hell. Go to hell. All right, he's completely flanked. You're gonna die. Looks like we got it now. G freaking G. There's still that one guy who's pretty far away. Not super concerned about him. You come down there. Um, I kind of feel like I maybe want to keep my two snipers up there for now. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, we'll, we'll bring them both. Okay. We'll bring them both. He's still way over there. I just figure like at some point he might come out. Explosive grenades, okay. Yeah, I know some of them have rocket launchers, and you gotta be careful to take out the rocket launcher people first. So you just cover for now. Hostiles. Oh, hello. So this guy needs to die as quick as possible. So we're gonna run up here. 2.4 seconds, and I'm gonna shoot him flat on his face. You're just gonna charge, because once again, we need him to die as soon as possible. So just get up here and start shooting. Knocked him down. I can't shoot if you don't move. All right, and there's still this one last guy. Can you aim? No, you can't. Come into cover, take a shot. Then give me her. Cover. Shoot. Okay. And then you come over here, and you come over here, and you're basically just looking for any enemies over in this direction. Do we miss our 55 and 60? Ooh, somehow we shot him through the barrel. All right. Okay, I think we good. That was fun. Took a lot longer than I expected. Oh my gosh, we're at 54 minutes. I was like, after that first one, I was like, yeah, let's go do a second one, because it didn't take that long, and <laughs> this one took like an hour. Soldiers clear out the village village center, and they see a comrade being abducted by the enemy. Hmm. What have we stumbled into? Dead civvies in a pit? These masked freaks setting fire to everything? Whatever the balled up mess is, I say we steer clear of it. We can't, they nab the scrawny recruit fried in, you see, we can't just leave him behind. Okay. 
Sweet. Well, with that, I hope you guys enjoyed the first episode. If you did, drop a like, comment, let me know what you think. As always, hit the subscribe button, join the game, comment, share your support. I'll see you guys later. Bye, everyone.